Hello everyone, the lighting's gonna be horrible, the background's gonna be horrible. This is gonna be a very horrible video production, but we're gonna make it. This is me, I'm Holly, welcome to my YouTube channel. We're gonna be doing a My Twin Macari unboxing. As you probably do not know, I've been obsessed with My Twin for the past couple of weeks. Um, I've been watching a lot of unboxings, I joined a collector group, I've just done the whole shebang. I love My Twin, they're very, unique dolls um they started in 1990 they end in 2016 they are very popular they had 23 inch dolls toddlers babies my twin uh, my cuddly sister and brothers and they were supposed to be designed to look like you and then you can also buy some that weren't designed to look like you um you would send in a picture or you can do little things where you can get like a little thing on the website and you can collect certain facial features Towards the end of it, they ended up discontinuing the 23 inch dolls and they ended up doing um, only 18 inch dolls like American Girl. It very much plummeted and they ended up doing um, the 99 cent store, 99 cent special where everything was 99 cents. You can buy bodies, wigs, wig charts, wig magazines, all of it. And then there's also a rumor that some of the face molds are in China. You can buy them off AliExpress, but I've looked and I haven't found any, so. This comes from Akari. And it was with FedEx. I'm surprised this My Twin is in this box. The seller is selling another My Twin, which some she said it's rare and she's selling it for $100. But I honestly asked the collector group and they said that she's not rare. She's a very common head mold. This one does have joints. So she, open, uh, she can be posed. That's why she probably fits in this Amazon package. I've been at work all day, so I haven't been able to, like, have a look. I know they're nothing special. I don't know this face mold. She's wearing a common outfit that I already own. Now you can't really get my twins online anymore. You can only get them online through eBay, Mercari, Etsy. They aren't very reasonably priced. They are very reasonably priced depending on the TLC or the rareness. But sometimes they can be a little expensive if they are. Um, the shipping, the shipping can be expensive. I'm very surprised she fits in this Lowe's bag. I just love my twins. At first I wasn't really about them, but now I felt I have fallen in love with them. She's like stretched to the gods. Like look at this. She's doing the whole exorcist. Okay. So like I said, the my twins are supposed to be designed to look like you, and some people think that's a little creepy. She's wearing her original outfit, the standard outfit that they come in. She's wearing her original socks, original shoes. I have the My Twin outfit like this. I bought it off of eBay because I thrifted a My Twin like this, as you guys saw from that unboxing video. But I didn't know the My Twin outfit came with purple shoes, so I ordered black ones. So her outfit is not really as cohesive. But I love them. I probably will do an updated like little like um, video on them. I'm trying to like correct her ligaments. She has the brown body. She has the special undies. She was like stuck in there and shipment. So freaking wonky. I don't mind having the same outfit. You can always dress them up in something else. I've been watching So For Dolls unboxings. She only has seven videos, but they're super cute. Hold on, her hair is stuck. I'm gonna do a whole facial screening. Just give me a second. Her hair is like stuck to the Velcro. If you guys are watching this video and you know the face mold before I do, I mean, if you know the face mold, comment down below. She has the purple hair tie in her hair. I don't know if that's original or not. Here's her facial screening. Here's her bangs. She has like curlyish hair. Her feet are like doing some other demonic thing because she's been stuck and shipping for so long like this. She was there for like, I don't even know. There's staples on her shirt, which kind of is giving her holes. I wonder if it's like the staple from like the price tag. Like this lady got it at the thrift store. I'll have to figure out how to get those off. They're right here on her shirt.
it's very great it's very interesting learning all the face molds faces i don't know who this is but she has really pretty eyes they're like a grayish blue she has a nude lip blondish hair i'm trying to get all the hair out of her face blonde eyebrows I think she's really adorable. I didn't know about my twin until 2019. No, 2022. I think I found my first one in 2021 after the pandemic. Um, I started collecting Cabbage Patch Kids at the end of 2017, beginning of 2019, 2018. Sorry, I'm like tired. So, I was a little late to the game on these, but um, they have very different versions of these. You can very much tell the qualities from the earlier years, from the later years. They have white body, brown body, and then some white body are posable, some brown body are posable, some white body are not posable. The posable brown body, uh, posable, the non posable white body are like iffy. I have one, I have two coming on the way. I do have one in the box coming on the way, so that would be a little fun thing to film because i want to show you what they look like in the box but yeah this is her i love her hair it's very beautiful very long she's very cute i enjoy her i'm gonna look at the face chart after i'm done filming this to see what her face chart is so i can know her name i don't usually give them names i just give them the names that they come with i think i have two kates kissing kates i have i want to say an allison but i don't think i do there's some that are really rare and it's like the ones that are like more ethnic and it sucks that the ones that are more eth ethnic cost the most, but maybe one day I'll find them thrifting. I don't know. I don't thrift as much anymore. That's why I don't do thrift hauls. Um, I don't do a lot of the stuff I used to do because life is a highway, a very different day. Um, I don't thrift as much because one, I don't have the time. Two, I haven't been able to find as much thrifting. I have always, like the past month and a half, left with either one, two, empty-handed. There is like occasionally where I find stuff good, but then you have to drive to like different cities to thrift. I don't know. But yeah, this is her. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day, night, afternoon, and I'll talk to you all in the next one. Goodbye.